Hi everyone, welcome back to Life with Crumbs. My name is Tanya, thank you for stopping by. Today I am sharing with you a children's place haul. Now, if you're not new to my channel, you already know that I only shop when there are huge sales or clearance deals happening and this is definitely no exception. Right now, Children's Place is having a 60 to 80% off their site, and I took full advantage of that. Um, my not, mm, I almost said nine. My now 10-year-old um, is in need of a few new pieces, and this was the perfect time to take advantage of the sale prices, clearance prices, end of the season, etc. And I stocked him up. He was in desperate need for some new jeans. There's a particular style and color he likes, so I basically just got multiples of the same style. So just a pair of blue jeans, not a super dark wash, but kind of a dark rinse. So these were the most expensive items, and I believe I paid six or seven dollars for each of those. So I did pick up a couple pairs of pajamas for him. Um, we pretty much love to live in our fleece pajamas pretty much year round, so they definitely get a lot of use, and he was in need of a couple new pair. So the first pair I picked up were these pizza and a game controller, I guess, um, pajamas. And they are a one piece zip up. It does have the hood on it. I guess that is a new thing, start putting hoods on pajamas. I don't know, I've been seeing it a lot lately. And these do not have the feet, they have the cuff at the bottom. So that does help give us a little extra growing room as well. So I thought these were really cute print, very fitting for him. He loves pizza and he loves his video games, so these are great. The second pair of pajamas I picked up were in this shark print. They just have sharks all over them in the blue. Again, it has the hood. And then again, it is footless. It just has a little cuff at the bottom. So I am sure that he will love them. They are super soft. They seem to wash up really well. The other pairs that we've gotten have lasted a really long time. So I'm sure that these will be the same. He was in need of some new shirts because he is growing so tall. So we did pick up quite a few shirts. I have a pile of them here, both short and long sleeved. So first one I picked up was this dinosaur in the city. Whoa, my bad. He likes dinosaurs, so I'm sure that he will like that. It's one good thing about boys is my boys have never really been picky about what they wear. I pretty much pick out their clothes and they don't care. So fingers crossed it stays that way. It makes my life a lot easier, especially when it's already hard to find what I consider nice clothes or cute clothes for boys. Okay, moving on. Um, so this one is a Ninja Donut. Donut mess with me. I thought he would find that funny. Here is another dinosaur, this time in a long sleeved t-shirt, powered by fossil fuel, driving the motorcycle. I'm sure that he will find that very ironic. If found gaming, do not disturb. Here is another short sleeve tee with the dinosaur or burger vor on it. I picked up just a plain striped tee in kind of a navy blue, a lighter blue, and a white stripe. Just a basic. Break up some of those graphic tees with something plain. Here is a long sleeve tee with the meh emoji. Not quite sure how I feel about a white t-shirt, but have a slice day. Cute. He's pretty easy on clothes, so I guess I shouldn't be too worried as far as staining or anything goes, but it is white, so there's always that possibility. But I thought that was cute. There's a long sleeve tee in black, and again, it's another dinosaur. This one is completely appropriate for him game controllers. Get your game on. Are you sick of dinosaurs yet? Not just yet. A couple more. Short sleeved gray tee and I've got a 
dinosaur going through the city there. Here is another long sleeve tee. I bet you can't guess what's on it. Hopefully he doesn't get sick of dinosaurs anytime soon. Next up is a short sleeve t-shirt. I'm majoring in sarcasm. And the last shirt I picked up for him is a short sleeve t-shirt with dinosaurs. I did pick up just a couple of items for my two-year-old. He is growing really uh, tall, and so he's outgrowing his current pajamas and in need of some new ones. So I did grab a couple pair of those for him. I got these red and blue striped, and they are just the cotton pajamas. These aren't the fleece ones, um, and they do have the feet in them um, with the little gripper bottoms, which I really like because we have hardwood floors. So these are kind of a necessity. So I got this pair for him, and then this one in a fire truck print. Same thing, the cotton pajamas, and um, they do have the non-grip feet inside of them. And my little guy is really hard on <laughs> clothing in general, but he was in need of a new jacket to throw into the rotation, so I did pick this up for him. It does have the Sherpa lined hood, which I really liked, and it's uh, just a navy blue with a dinosaur print. Obviously, dinosaurs are very big at the children's place right now, so I don't know if it's just in general dinosaurs are popular or if it's just something popular with um, the children's place, but they're everywhere, obviously. And I don't know, the jacket is actually Sherpa lined as well. So it'll be nice and warm for those cooler spring days when it's a little bit too warm for a winter jacket, not quite warm enough for a light jacket. So this will be perfect. And the thing I really love about Children's Place is that the clothing is great quality. It always washes up nice. It lasts a long time. Um, I always buy my son's jeans at Children's Place because they have the adjustable waist, which is a necessity for him because he is really skinny. Um, so we have to have those waist adjusters um, and they wash up great. They hold up well. I don't have to worry about, you know, constantly getting holes or anything like that. So, okay, so that is it for my children's place haul. I don't think I mentioned it earlier, but I did pay between three and five dollars for each of the items I showed you with the exception of the jeans. I believe they were seven dollars a piece and the pajamas I think were also six or seven dollars. So. Overall, I did great. I saved a ton of money. Um, I will go ahead and add it up and put it over here for you um, so you can see what the retail cost would have been versus what I actually paid. Um, don't forget too, if you are a shopper at the Children's Place to use your Children's Place dollars or rewards dollars, whatever they call them. Um, also, if you do any ordering online, make sure to take advantage of Rakuten. That will give you um, a percentage back on your purchase and um, anything you can do to stretch your money, right? So that is just how I roll. So that does it for today's haul. Thank you so much for being here. If you like this video, please remember to give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next one. Bye everyone.